Hello. So right now, today we are in Minecraft in my creative world, and I'm going to show you how to go 20,000 blocks in the air. First, we're gonna need a time block and some observers. I suggest using bedrock, but this time I'm just going to use iron blocks, so I don't fly all over to the sides. Okay. Now, set your command block not to impulse, but to repeat, and then put... Yup! So, then after this laggy, this laggy layer of stuff, as soon as I can stop flying, I'm flying. I suggest you break everything, cause it's not gonna work if you keep making stuff. Then I don't know if I can make the And the way you can see that there will be 2000 blocks is that there's going to be at the position you can see that we are currently at 5. So when I break this, Yep. Yep. You can see the numbers escalating. 1,000, 2,000, 3,000, 4,000, 5,000, 6,000, 7,000. Yep. You can go very, very fast. I think the highest I've ever gone was 30,000 blocks. Yep. Easily 20,000. <laughs> well, so that's how you go up more than 40,000 blocks in Minecraft. The reason I don't suggest this is because one, it's gonna take a lot of materials because ender and crystals, oh my gosh, it's 60,000. Ender crystal, end crystals are expensive to make. The lag, the amount of damage is gonna do to your player because if it does this much explosions, then I don't think water is just gonna save you. And I was remembering the last thing, but I forgot. Hmm. Oh, we're going down now. It takes a long time to go down because you're going down slower than the amount of speed you're going higher. So... <laughs> Let me just speed up the process by going to speed. Potion. Oh...
their nars should be going way faster. Cause I think that's how it works. Yeah. I think it's working. Well, well, you can see here, this is our hall of destruction due to the explosion that launched us high up in the air. Hmm, very big. So anyways, that was the video. Well, I'm gonna go now. Bye!